Can we just admire all of these wooden eaves, which is present on all floors, and these massive windows, which is present from the outside, all throughout the insides of this home? Well, this is something that you don't see every day, or better yet, on all of our house tour videos. Are you guys ready to start the tour? top homes tour we know that it's raining but nobody's stopping us from touring this immense brand new home in Ayala Heights subdivision now I know that you guys are familiar with that village but did you know that this is actually one of Ayala land's first developments in Quezon City well the properties that's offered here is airy and within a tree-lined and highly exclusive community meaning that they offer this utmost peace and privacy to the future residents of this village now this property offers six bedrooms six toilet and baths an eight vehicle carport all within a floor area of 910 square meters on a 510 square meters lot so join us today even if it's raining and let's find a dream home you've always been looking for <laughs> okay so let's start with the facade it is such a gorgeous house, right? So it has this modern industrial design. You see this wooden eaves, this dark hues. So you have your automatic gates on that side, which is an entry to your garage, okay? So aside from that, you also see this gorgeous Calatea Lutea plants, which adds natural environment to the whole vibe of this home. Now, I know that there's a lot more things to see inside, so let's get going. Okay. All right. Wow. <laughs> the rain just makes everything look so much more dramatic. I mean, from this view, everything is just so elevated and gorgeous now we have these steps going up to our main entryway so come with me so i guess i can lose the umbrella now okay thank you for these gorgeous wooden eaves all right so from here let's point out on what we see so on my right hand you have your access to the eight vehicle carport and on my left is your access to the service area now a few more steps up you can see <laughs> you can see your front lawn which is gorgeous right and of course your huge solid wooden main door with its steel finish for the handles and what's so amazing with this is that the wooden accent or the wooden feature doesn't stop there it's even on the ceilings giving it more height so like i said everything is just so elevated now before we head on inside make sure that you guys are followed or subscribed to our youtube channel we also have our instagram and facebook at official top realty our website at www.toprealty.com.ph and of course our app which you can download right now so are you guys ready it started to rain again let's head on inside okay so upon entering you are greeted with this expansive gorgeous space and it's mind blowing now let's start it off with the living area now we all know that this the main floor is elevated so we have this gorgeous view of the outside through these glass panels come on over to this side okay so we have this double height ceiling and it covers half if not most of the main floors now what's behind me is this gray feature wall which can be a focal point of this room this could be where your tv is or this is where you can display your artwork okay so with this much space you can fit 
a huge lounging or sofa area. And also for the ceilings, by the way, it is made out of solid natural wood, alternating with that white structure or white ceiling, which is suspended to give it more tiering and style. Now let's get over to this side. If you think that's amazing, well, wait until you see this kitchen. Welcome to your kitchen. So, if you would notice, it's very sleek and minimalistic, right? And usually with kitchens, there's a lot of things going on from the food, the preparation, and the people who's using the space. So it's great that this is very sleek. Everything is pushed back. So let's start off with our counter space. All of the cabinets here and the shelvings are soft close. And just look at the color, right? Very neutral. We have this awesome backsplash over here and over to this side as well. So you have that, this is L-shape, right? Now, aside from that, you have this space allowance. So from the space, check the lighting, check and the ventilation. This kitchen has it all covered. Now, this is your island counter. You have this gorgeous finish for your countertop and you have your Tika or Teka range hood which is very very modern and also with its built-in induction top okay so you have shelvings over or storage underneath and this can also be a breakfast nook if you like you just have to put in stools or seating over to this side then you're good to go okay so right next to it or across it is your dining area right now this is open and it's framed by solid wood also but definitely it depends on you guys you can have this closed if you want making it an enclosed dining so you have all of this space and all of this natural lighting aside from that it's very consistent with all of our wood materials so you have your recess ceiling your pvc wood and your cove lighting now over to my left hand is your built-in table which can serve as a buffet table or this is something where you can display your items you also have these storage right because you have a very minimalistic and you know very sleek interior so it's good to keep your items hidden or in the storage so you have this end-to-end -end wall overlooking the side of the house and your sliding doors leading you to an area which we will show you right now okay so what do we have over here can I open these sliding doors now oh. <laughs> okay all right so coming over to this side right now we have this huge space for your lounging you have your stone elements on these corners and you have this infinity pool right over to this side and check it out it's very nice right it's so modern and it's so different from all or some of the pools that we have seen. So it has a waterfall edge effect. It's very cozy, has a very cozy feel. And can you imagine how it looks like, especially during the evenings or at nighttime? What's so nice about this pool area is they have the seating area over to this side, right? So you can just sit here or for the kids, this is a nice area for them where they can enjoy the water stew or this is where you can have your drinks because you have this elevated space right here and that awesome lighting with its wooden panels which accentuates or remain consistent with the design of the whole house okay let's go over here oh you have this wooden slats also over to your ceiling so this pool area is half covered so the sun is not in your face now over here is an access so you have a few steps down to your front of the house or the side access of the house so let's go back going through our awesome show kitchen on the way to our auxiliary kitchen now this is locked so we wouldn't go there anymore if you would notice the design of your auxiliary kitchen is very consistent with your show kitchen it, it's not all the time that we see that it's nice that those who actually designed it 
think that way so it's very spacious this is u-shape same materials used for your countertops you have ample storage underneath and above and you also have this very modern range hood and cooktop okay let's go back awesome right now we see this main staircase leading you to the basement and the upper floors but let's check out these rooms first so these are the rooms that you actually see right when you enter so behind me is the powder room okay so it's very luxurious you have this granite finish for your walls which is consistent and it's from floor to ceiling giving it more height you have your enclosed shower and it's complete with its toilet and sink okay. right next to it is the first bedroom right. oh, this can also be a flexi room because it doesn't have its ensuite but if you're gonna turn this into a bedroom well no worries because right outside is the powder room complete with its shower area so let's focus on this space you have your windows over to this side you have your wooden accents on your ceiling and you have this amazing space right here you can you can turn this into your office or a fitness area or a bedroom like we said earlier okay so let's head on back do you guys know that we read your comments? In fact, I am going to read one from you guys. Well, this one is from Eric Ginto. Um, given that the host is gorgeous and speaks really good, I thought that the overall video was executed pretty well. well. Kudos to my team, right? Kudos to a great presentation princess. More power to top reality. Well, thank you so much. Alam nyo, we really work hard every episode just to give you this premium content. And we really appreciate it when you like and when you comment. And most especially when you subscribe to us. So do you guys have any properties that you'd love to enlist with us? Like your condos, residential, or even commercial spaces? Well, we'd love to work with you. Our top realty team are experts at that. And you are going to experience fast and amazing results. So go ahead and call us up. Now, let's get back to our tour. Imagine waking up to this. All of these textures, the tiering, and all of these glass panels reflecting all of the natural lighting from the outside. Good luck <laughs> for good luck. Okay, so before heading on up, let's go to the basements first. These solid wood is, are so nice. So you have solid wood for your steps and your railings and even a platform over here, right? Everything is so elevated with this home. So let's start off first with this door. So, oh, behind your staircase is an area which could be a storage room or a storage area. All right. Now, how often do you see bedrooms in the basement? This is actually perfect as an elderly room. Why? Because it's right across your carport, which we will show you guys later on. And so, we have echo because this is a big space. So you have wooden accents on your ceilings on both sides. You have this nice lighting and all of this space for your bed. Okay, your bed could be over at this side. Yeah, right? And you have these sliding doors which leads you to the stairs on the side of the house. Okay, so let's get over to this side. This is your ensuite toilet and bath with its built-in wardrobe. So you have your cabinets over here and a nice finish, stone finish for the walls and the flooring. So it's very consistent, making it monotonous and more spacious. Let's go back. All right, so right next to it is the service quarters. So come on over to this side. This is the room for your personnel 
and a wash area, a designated wash area. Just look at all of the space. So this gate opens up to the side of the house. So there's a designated washing area once again, but it's outdoors. And what's so nice with this space is all of the air coming in from this door. So it feels ventilated still, right? It's also nice that it's right next to the elderly room. And so if they need something, they can always call on the service personnel. This is a solid door, you guys. It's heavy, but it's very easy to maneuver because it's a swing door. So we are now at our eight vehicle carport. And what a space, even the flooring. What do you call this? So this is what they usually use, right? So it's not slippery for the vehicles or the car. So you can definitely fit eight or more depending, the si depending on the size of your vehicle. So right over here is your access from the main entrance and right on my right hand is your access to the service area, okay? So the doors to your service quarters are solid wood as well. Can you imagine that? Very considerate, right? Okay, so door one or service quarters one. And this is the, on, uh, the toilet and bath. Okay. Well, this, this is the storage. Or you can turn it into a service lounge if you want. Okay, so that is where you can place your mops or your car accessories or the things that you use to clean your cars, All right? So let's go back. You know what's so nice about the swing door is that coming from your cars, right? Sometimes you have groceries or you have lots of things you holding from your hands. So you don't have to put it down just to open this door. So all you have to do is to open it using your body force, then you're good to go. Okay? So with that, let's head on up. I hope that you guys can see my perspective from here. It's super nice and that accent wall just gives everything more height, right? So also, what's so special about these accent features is this one. So we see this from the basement up till here and it extends to the ceiling, right? So usually with the designers, they would just buy a whole slab, right? With this one, they actually place each slab, each slats one by one. So the texture and the color is different or it's not as, you know, as fake. It's very natural and it's very, um, original looking. Now, we're over here at the second floor. Can you see how wide the hallway is? Added to that are, is this gorgeous dark wood flooring, okay? So we have four bedrooms over to this floor. So let's check out the first room. Okay? So the flooring is very consistent with the rest of the floors. Over here is the ensuite toilet and bath. Okay, very nice. And you have this wooden accent on your ceiling and cold lightings. So this window over here overlooks the side of the house. Now all of the, uh, not all, but three of the rooms over to this floor are kind of similar when it comes to the layout, but let's check them out. Okay. Wow. Let's go through here. Here we go. Same layout, right? Same floorings, but this time the ensuite toilet and bath is right over to this side. Same windows, looking at the side of the house, ensuite toilet and bath, and we're back to the hallway. So this has exactly the same layout as with the second bedroom that we looked into. So let's proceed with this door over here. This is a huge solid door, but guess what's inside? It's a storage room. <laughs> okay, so with this much space, you can still put a lot, but imagine they still put a solid wooden door for your storage room. 
very nice okay so before we head on inside i just wanted to prepare you guys because this is the master bedroom so let's go oh super nice just look at this master bedroom and what caught my eye right away is this wooden accent right over here which can definitely frame your king size bed so these are actually wooden slats which are colored black giving it more emphasis that this is the master of all bedrooms in this home so you have these uh, two glass panels on both sides okay so you still have these glass panels over at this side and this double door is the ensuite toilet and bath so come check this out this ensuite definitely deserves a double door. Why? You'll see later on. So over here, you have your sink and counter with its huge mirror. Now on my left hand is the enclosed shower area, your water closet, and this whole space for your bathtub. Very luxurious, right? Now, I wanted to show you this part real quick. So here, you can definitely put a vanity area. So you have all of this counter space for your makeup, for your toiletries, etc. But what's so interesting with this space is this dark hued colored cabinets or your wardrobe. Okay, so you have cabinets all over, gorgeous finish for your folded clothes. There, okay. All of these are cabinets and it's from floor to ceiling. So this would definitely fit all of your wardrobe, regardless on how much it is. So I guess that's it for this room. So let's head on up. Okay, of course we save the best for last. This hallway, Gorgeous perspective of different textures and materials. Your very seamless glass panel over there overlooking the front of the house and of course your balcony. Oh, right? Bad weather. <laughs> okay, so what's so special about this balcony, even if it's just this in size is that it has this amazing view of the community from here so you have all of these trees the front of the house and over here is your view of the main entryway so you have your front lawn and all of the calatea lutea plants that we see earlier during our entrance right such a weather and i guess that's it for this gorgeous gorgeous home Wow, such a warm and family-friendly house. And have you noticed all of these natural light bouncing off of these white walls? It makes everything look more spacious and expansive. Now, in terms of proximity, it's very close to the top universities here in the Philippines. Now, we have Ateneo, Miriam College, and the University of the Philippines. Now, you are a fan of shopping? Well, it's in close proximity as well to Eastwood Libis, Trinoma, and SM. Now, let's talk about this home. You have all of this warm wood accents. By the way, these are solid wood, you guys. All of these whites, high ceiling, and all of these glass panels just mix up for the whole vibe of this whole home. And also, not only the height allowance when it comes to the ceiling, you also have these very spacious bedrooms and your eighth carport for your vehicles. I mean, if you love entertaining your guests and loved ones, then this home is definitely for you. So satisfied? Are you guys interested in seeing this property in person? Well, don't hesitate to contact us via the numbers that you see on your screen below. Again, I'm Princess and this is Top Realty, your partner in real estate. I hope you enjoyed the tour as much as we did. Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell so you get notified of our new uploads. Also, if you are interested in selling or enlisting your property with us, please do message us and it might just get featured on our channel.